Welcome back to our 10th video on PHP and MySQL, and please bear with me because I went out last night and had one too many brew dogs, and I'm definitely paying for it right now. But hey, what are you going to do? The show's got to go on. So I want to show you guys what I mean by how PHP is a server-side scripting language. So if we go ahead and write something here, we'll just go ahead and use this from our last video, PHP Echo Hello World. I'll save it. I'll reload it in our browser. We're on the same page. Okay, perfect. Okay, so what do I want to do? I want to view the page source, and in any browser, on any website, you can check out what's underneath their hood. So you can either right-click, view source, or if you know the keyboard shortcut on a Mac, it is Option-Command-U. It shows us what's underneath the hood. So why didn't our PHP tag show up? Well, that's because you can't check any back-end language by viewing page source. Other back-end languages include, I don't know, Perl, Python. Uh, Ruby. I think Facebook was built in Perl, or was it PHP? Either way, they both pretty much do the exact same thing. As you continue learning programming language languages, you'll soon figure out that all programming languages are a lot more similar than you think. It's not like learning English and then trying to learn Japanese or learn Italian. I mean, that's way harder. Once you learn one programming language, one language, they all kind of fall together because they all use the same keywords, the same loops, the same if else statements. So just keep that in mind. And again, when you view a page source, you only get to see the front end. Front end includes the HTML, the CSS, the JavaScript. Um, what else am I missing? That's pretty much it. HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. And you can also keep in mind that you can view any website's front end. So I'll go ahead and I'll open up. I'll create another tab right here and I'll just do here's the first website I ever built San Diego Pro window cleaning.com so we're like hey I like what this guy did over here or I want to know how big this wrapper is in pixels so I can just view page source and it shows me what's underneath this hood right here and if you hit command F or control F on a PC you can search for words and I'll type in CSS right here and it shows me all the CSS in here and I want to source this file where is the CSS where's the style sheet I don't know maybe it's because I'm in uh, what am I in Safari no I'm in Firefox but you, ordinarily in any other browser you could be able to click on the style sheet and it would open up so you could see what this guy's doing. Every website in the world is open source, but just keep in mind that we can't check out PHP from looking underneath the hood because PHP is a server language and the browser and the server are two completely entities. This, what we're on right now, our browser, this is our front end and our server, which is um, where all our information is being held on our Apache is somewhere else. So just don't be afraid if you type something you and then you look it up or you view the page source and your PHP tags don't show up. They never will show up and there's no way to ever run a program to see someone else's PHP tag show up. So keep that in mind and I'll see you guys in the next video.